What up everyone, Raven Grim Killers Ignited, also known as Handy XP. Welcome back to more scary games. Uh, first of all, I hope I'm recording. Yes I am. Good to know. So, some people have been dying for more scary games, and uh, I don't know what to expect, so if this is a jump scare game, this will be the very first time that I'm jumping in into something new um, from the indie series. Uh, this is called Within. I don't know anything about it. I just found it, got it, and hopefully it doesn't lag and all that sh bullshit. So here we go. Let's just jump right on in, right? They abandoned the god who had made them. They sacrificed them to demons whom they knew not. Satanic cult. That's that's a little. Uh, I hope this music isn't. I haven't copied. heard from my brother in over three months, which wasn't unusual. Nick tends to disappear for months at a time, not returning my calls, and then he surfaces again as if nothing had happened. I've gotten used to it. I don't blame him, considering the childhood we had. I've read somewhere that siblings with shared traumatic pasts tend to grow apart faster when they're adults. Then, last night at around 3 a.m., he left a voice message. I heard it when I woke up a few hours later. My I must have called him dozens of times, but there was no answer. And then his phone was switched off. I took the next available flight out early next morning. I didn't sleep a wink on the plane. I kept thinking about what kind of trouble he might be in. As soon as I landed, I checked into a motel and then took a cab to the last address I had for him. In the pre-dawn light, the city seemed to grow more decrepit the further in I went, like a thing whose core was growing rotten. I don't know what kind of trouble he's in, but when we were growing up, after Ma died, when it was just the two of us, he'd come to me when he was in real deep and needed saving. And I would save him. By the way, it's about four o'clock in the morning for me. Where the hell are we? First of all, and second of all, I wouldn't be going out and looking around, you know? I should get this over with quickly. I'll find him, make sure he's okay, then head back. I'm already missing a day at work. Let's see, he should be at apartment 405. Oh, an apartment complex, okay. Oh no, oh no, it's, oh my God, sensitivity. Good God, oh, I can't even change my sensitivity. Oh dear, okay, um, fuck. First of all... Gross, looks like it hasn't been emptied in days. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Just trash, I should keep moving. I didn't mean to click it. Um, first of all, this landlord needs to be sued, okay? Just right off the bat, the bitch needs to be sued. Um, 405 you said, huh? I can't run or nothing, so that's good to know. I don't have to be chased, that's 412. Looks like there's a pipe busted up in there. It isn't a good idea to move this scaffold. It looks flimsy. I should just find another way around it. You mean to tell me you can't just like shift it just a little bit? Maybe not even like slide your ass? I bet this building breaks every municipal code in existence. I could get this open with a hard push, but I really shouldn't be wasting time. I need to find Nick. 
I should get to apartment 405. Look, man, I'm trying, okay? I get it. The, the place is horrible, but if you can get somewhere, get somewhere. I don't really care. Why, why not just use the elevator? Nope. Okay, well. 401. Okay, here we go. Yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Look at this shit. Excuse me, uh, 411 looks broken. I mean, maybe that's just normal. You know, that's normal. You see that in a lot of apartment complexes, right? That's 404. Nope, can't move it. Need to find another way around. You are as useless. You know what? I'm not going to judge you. You know, I don't know your situation. turn my volume up and I'm gonna fucking regret that because I'm gonna shit my pants on camera my screen dimmed again I hate it because I have an old ass TV one of those old LG Samsung's every time I'm in the dark room I see more black on my screen than I do anything else nope not that way you know my screen goes dark and I gotta lean in close if I'm leaning in close and I get jump scared Fuck my life. Hello? Oh, that was rude. Yeah, hello? Huh, where'd they go? There was someone just here. I didn't see anything. Well, okay. this is it. I should just ring the doorbell, see if he answers. Although, if he's been drinking, I don't have much hope. Look. Ding dong. Anybody home? Pizza service. It's your fucking sister. Open I guess it. he's either not home or he's sleeping off a drunken binge, which would not be entirely surprising. Maybe I should just try to open the door and let myself in. Yeah, there you go. That's a good idea. Let's just walk on in. Oh. Gosh, what is that smell? Come on, man. Nick? Nick, are you here? Why? There's gotta be a light switch somewhere. Can you just stop talking? I'm already scared as it is. I don't need you fucking talking. Now that's just nasty. How is he living like this? This is terrible. I was about to ask that, you know? Musali fruit, strawberry milk, Would it hurt dishes. to clean up a little? Okay, apparently so with this guy. Look at this shit. You know what? This is what slumlords live like. Dude. I heard a footstep to my right. Do not open. Go back. Okay. You know what? You don't have to tell me twice. I'm just going to go this way. How's your bathroom look, by the way? It's, it's decent. Okay. I don't mind that. Right, like this is gonna keep me out. There might be a dead body in there. Nick, are you in there? Are you okay? Open this door. I guess Hello. I should find some other way to get it open. Like what? I guess I should find some other way to get it open. You know what? Like what? What the hell am I gonna use? A pizza box? A broken, or, you know, a bottle? Use this, uh, yeah, a photo of this old woman. Didn't know he kept this old picture of Ma. This was taken oh. maybe a year before she died? Before the cancer started turning her into skin and bones? Yeah, that usually... You almost scared me. When Ma got sick, he was eight and I was 15. We watched her waste away and die from cancer. We never knew our father. No kid should have to lose both parents so early. Hmm. I don't know what that just said. Looks like he's literally living out of a suitcase at this point. He told me he was making money on a freelance web development gig. Was that all a lie? What's he doing with the money he gets? I... Don't want to know. You Why know? can't he get a bed like a normal person? The dude's the dude's broke. You know he probably got you know robbed. 
So I gotta find something to open a stupid door in the damn house. So... What the hell would I use? Nothing to crouch or nothing, and I don't have to... What do I do? Do I go out? Do I go outside the house? I guess I should find some other way to get it open. Screw you. The first thing I'm going to help him do is clean this place up. I'm here. That alone should bring some positivity to his life situation. I'm gonna bring some positivity to get the fuck out of here. That's what I'm gonna do. I can't leave. What am I gonna use to open the goddamn door? Well, there you go. Looks like he's fallen off the wagon again. Oh, Nick, I sometimes think if he hadn't had that accident, if his best buddy Alex hadn't been killed, things might have turned out different for him. He was 16, driving home from a party. Alex in the passenger seat. It would be nice if we can talk faster. Oh, that ain't good. Nick had no business being behind the wheel that night. He was drunk out of his mind. Like anybody else is gonna drive him. Alex was killed on the spot. Nick survived, but he could never forgive himself for Alex's death. Oh. With Ma gone, I was supposed to be the parent. Rein him in. I should have been tougher with him. I messed up there. I guess I neglected him when it mattered. That's on me. You're goddamn right it is. What's also on you is getting this door open, so tell me how. Do I rip this fucker down? Do I, uh... What a... Can you... Hello? Nick, are you in there? Quit playing. You know, I really don't want to. Hey, um... You want some I leftovers? I think I just lost my appetite. I don't... It's not for you, bitch. It's for the god fucker in there. You want some leftovers? Hey, we got leftovers. Oh, oh my shit. Hello? Hello? How did this door open? Ghost. There's gotta be a light switch somewhere. Look, it's to your fucking right. Turn it on. Well, at least I know where all his money's going. But where the hell is he? It's sure to fuck in here, and I don't want to go all the way in, because if I get locked in here, I'm going to be really pissed. I wonder if he still actually plays. He was obsessed with the guitar for a while. All right. All right, he was obsessed with it. I get it. That's nice. I'm he used actually... to love these consoles growing up. He'd spend hours locked into those games. I guess it was an escape for him after Ma passed, and we were living at Aunt Sheba's. The worst period of our lives. He was such a quiet kid back then. Who the hell get, has a name Sheba? It sounds like something straight out of a fantasy movie. I mean, also, what kind of console is this? It's like some kind of Xbox, but I've never fucking seen that before in my life. It is an Xbox, something like that. USB a USB drive. drive. Maybe it'll come in handy. Yeah, maybe it will. You know, maybe. Random drawer junk. Typical, typical woman. Nothing useful here. Nothing useful here. Okay, yeah, sure. Alright then. What's with the footsteps? Hmm? I should check this computer. Maybe it'll give me some clue to what's going on with him. That's why I should I... turn on this computer. <laughs> nice computer, by the way. I gotta do it myself. I could probably use the USB drive I found in that drawer. Do you need a USB drive to operate this shit? Okay. Great. I'm so happy for it. I'm gonna get jump scared, man. What the fuck is this? I finally got it all set up. The Sandbox OS, a secure, heavily modded Linux 
variant running as a VPC and the game contained within, this may be overkill, but it's better to be cautious considering the urban legend around this game. Single XC file, not very clearly named, cleverly named. No instructions to think it took me six months to track it down on the dark web. The things I had to trawl through to find it. Uh, things I don't think I can ever unsee. Uh, I don't have much hope for humanity anyway. We're broke beyond redemption. I'll continue taking these notes in the text files if this game is the real deal. I can later use them to compose a post documenting my journey for the r slash occult. I kind of fucking figured. Subreddit. Anyway, first things first. I have to get the game to work. It keeps crashing when I click it. The lore says that it probably works at random. You just have to keep clicking. The code is probably corrupt. Stories about the game are fascinating, if not profoundly disturbing. For example, a guy who played it, a blah blah blah. Okay, great. That's a great username. All right, let's play it. We don't have any start menu or nothing like crap cleaner, any bullshit. Alright, I'm leaving. Never mind. Hey! Are you shitting me, man? Come on now. I hate this shit. I'm gonna get jump scared right out of my ass. Why would I be playing a scary game inside a scary game considering the house that I'm sitting in is fucking haunted? I can't run. Don't do that shit. Why would you want to track this game down in the first place? You're setting me up for a massive jump scare, are you? Aren't you? I'm done. Nope. I'm leaving. There's nothing in there. Wait a minute. There's something changing. Hey, uh, my name is Maya. Also known as Andy XP. And I would like to say that if you can open the door if I can progress, it'd be freaking awesome. Also, I just wanted to say, you're not doing a good job at cleaning this whole place up. And so if the state walked in and saw this, it'd be quite nasty. Hey, what's up? Something about a mountain. Sounds like something. If you could play it out in reverse, that'd be great. I don't even want to go to hell anymore. If that's how they talk, I don't want to go to hell. I'm serious. I don't. 
I don't want to talk like that. I want to talk like a normal person. Dude, I'm hearing too many noises, bro. I hate it. I fucking hate it already. Tracking this game down for what? What, to scare the shit out of your uh, people that play it? That, um... Hey, my name is Andy XP. I'm a YouTuber at the very bottom of the totem pole. I don't have a whole hell of a lot of viewers, maybe about 70 or something. And they're really cool people, too. Oh! Not in my ear, you asshole. Siren Head. Was it? I mean, I don't know. It looked like it. Come on, man. I was enjoying that. Wait. That file wasn't there before. I'm sure of it. Gotta run. First impressions. A creepy, grainy, pixelated PS2 era style walking sim. Yep. That game's unstable. I've crashed four times already. Good thing I sandboxed it. It's chewing up files and then randomly spitting them back. No credits, no title screen, no save load. Whoever made it did a horrible job. It was hard to find so many fake leads and bullshit. I, sh I would have given up sooner if I don't have believed there was some truth to the stories. Stumbled across the game by accident. Okay, something. There's going to be a zip archive. Many of them are full of unspeakable images. Some, some pretty sh weird shit. So basically, the myth is that only one copy can exist at a time. Uh, this game will allow itself to be found by whatever it wants, whoever it wants to find it. Uh, it wasn't created by human hands. It was birthed on the dark web slash the deep web. The abomination conceived. Okay, so yeah, some hell thing from hell built this thing. And I'm going to drag this up here. I'm going to drag this. You know what? I'm just going to leave it there. I'm going to play the game. Thank you. You saved my progress. You're driving me up a wall, you know that? Just you talking in general. It's just a walking adventure, you know? No. It's just an adventure, you know? It's like Indiana Jones. You have a lot of fun walking. It's like a ghost hunt, you know? You just kind of have fun with it. You just don't think anything of it. You'd be a thug. And I am locked in. First off, what I'd like to do is clean all this up. Second of all... Huh? Wait a minute. No. Hey, I need to click on you again. What do I do? Dude, this game is bullshit. This game is absolute... Not the game I'm actually playing, but th this game in the game is crap. I can't find anything. Hello? Am I just going to have to walk back and forth? good. Hey, buddy. There's the occult in here. I am the devil now. Good freaking question.
I'm pretty sure that was Nick's photo in there. But that makes no sense. Gee, you're telling me. I've got to get this game going again. No, you don't. No, you don't. You know what? We just shut it off. Looks like it's crashed. I should restart the computer. No, you really shouldn't. You really shouldn't. And you know what? I'm going to go check room 11 because, um, reasons. I'm going to go check I it. I can't leave just yet. I need to find Nick. He's not here. You're not going to find him in a computer. I can't leave yet. Let's just I'm not leave. Done here. You know, you women are all like. Why don't you take it a piece of pizza? It hasn't gotten any more appetizing since I last looked. You know, I really don't want to get jump scared, but I feel like you being naive Looks is like going to happen. Looks like it's crashed. Jeez, that scared me. <laughs> Just the lights. You the electrics going. here are falling apart Ooh, like the rest of the building. Yeah, just like the lights in the rest of the building. Why would you want to be on this anyways? Fuck. Why? Getting worse, growing signs of malevolence, walking nightmares, oppressive thoughts, general malice, malice. An intense craving for self-defilement. Weird sounds from the other room. Voices, footsteps, shifting shadows. An hour ago, a webcam turned on by itself and took a picture. Yo, if mine does that, I'm going to be pissed. I was able to identify the entity from the symbols and the graffiti. Bale Nagan, a.k.a. the ill spirit of guilt and grief. Here's the ed entry from... Deacon, perhaps the only demonology wiki with some authenticity, a greater demon from the pre-biblical times. Require some kind of human sacrifice, that's great. Sex offenders, serial killers, all dying of feed, dead men walking, guilt born. Wow, PTSD, war survivors. Now where the fuck am I? No. No, man. No. This is so much worse. My, uh... Nah, I'm good. Listen, hey. Um. You know, this is the point where I wish Dashy was here. You know, he could save my ass. Listen, I don't want to go there. I don't want any trouble. I'm just trying to find my brother and just get out, you know? Is that okay? <laughs> I'm not falling for it. I'm just not. Hello? Dude. I found you. Why, you're not gonna talk to me? Fuck it, I'll just go see what the dude wants. No, maybe he just wants, he just wants to pull. He just, he just wants to pull. That's all he wants, just give it to him. Let him have it. Let him smash. What would the harm be? Hey, buddy. Thanks, bud. Well, I'm gonna offer you some pill if you want it. He's gotta promise not to kill me. You know, that weird shit. You no, know, that's the problem with being in an area where you got the front and the back. Because I can't run either. If I get jump scared, dude, I'm gonna be really pissed. I hope you fucking realize that. I don't mess with this stuff. Two out of four. Yo, I'm legit squeezing my mouse. Like, my hand has fallen asleep. Doesn't get any worse, right?
fuck you, dude. Fuck you. That was rude. I absolutely hate you. Yep, that's the one. That's the that's the thought. You keep that thought. Yes, sir. That's right. That's right. You tell him. Yep. I 100% agree, buddy. I 100% agree. Yep. Okay. I don't know what you're saying, but I'm agreeing. I know, right? Well, your speech is pretty horrible. I just hope you can't hear my microphone, because if you can, I'm going to be really, really screwed. This is driving me nuts. Why? Why would I ever look up? Why? There's nothing else here. Literally. Hey, Motor Mouth. Do you know where the other two pages are? Hey. Hey. Laser lips. Oh. Oh, hell no. Alright, I'll find it myself. Thanks, bud. Hey, Nick. Help me. Please. You have to help me. Yeah, Nick? you. <laughs> I'm scared by her. It's awful here. Please. Help me. Yeah, like, you know. Fucking ass. Oh, come on. That was Nick's voice. I'm sure of it. <laughs> yeah. Gotta okay. get this PC going again. Listen, you've been smoking a lot of weed. <sighs> Hello? Is someone there? Nah, the computer just needs to be restarted. I'll restart it later. I need to check if there's someone in here with me. I swear to God, you suck. So bad. Like, legit. It's too dark in here. I should get the lights on. What do you think I'm doing, you asshole? I can't leave just yet. I need to find Nick. Dude, just fucking bounce. There's been shit happening. I hate you for right now. Okay. One or two things is gonna happen. One, I'm gonna pull that. And I'm gonna I'm gonna become a little girl. Or B. I'm gonna pull that. And nobody's gonna be there. And then I'm gonna become a little girl. Cause I'm gonna get jump scared. Either way, I'm a dead man. All right, I'm coming in there. Um, I'm gonna bring some milk. Is that okay? Buddy, <sighs> nothing. Nobody. But his face. What is happening to me? It's the drugs you took. I don't think you're. I don't think you're as innocent as your brother was. Oh my God. Grandma don't oh, look too good. That's awful. How could the picture have changed like this? D is this enough to tell you to fucking leave? 
to what you just witnessed, bitch, I mean, a normal person that's saying that's not on drugs would be literally like, oh yeah, sure, let's restart a computer. Alex, today he was here in the apartment standing by the far wall. He looked the same as he did when I saw him all those years. Something in the morgue the day after the accident. His dead body cold. His dead body cold. His face split open. His eyes wide. Stop with the sound. Someone was grinning. Like someone was smiling while he was dead. Alex was. While he survived, even though he was the one drunk driving. Want me to follow him, beg for forgiveness, but I know it's too late. We call Mile and Warner, stay put, and not to come looking for me, because I know Mile, she'll look for me if she doesn't hear from, from me too long. Yeah, she does, and you know what? You're, I wanted to let you know, though. Your sister is an asshole. She's dumb. She doesn't understand. And by the way, you need a new computer. I can't drag these things right here. I don't, I don't like it not being organized. Number one. And besides, what made you think your sister was gonna listen anyways? Mine doesn't. What? What am I in, a sex dungeon? Oh, I hate this. Hey. Oh. Why is it dark as shit? Dude, there's nothing here. This is not good. Oh, my name is Andy. Yes. This is where shit gets real. That don't sound good. Listen, my name is Andy, not Maya. Maya is the retarded girl that is in this game. Fucking dick. <sighs> Fuck you. Fuck everything about you. You know what, after this, I don't even want to go to hell. I'm willing to drop all my porn. All of it. I will drop it all. Come on, man. Stop. Hey, there's a person. Hey, buddy. I want to say hello to you. Can you kill me, please? I wish I knew what you were saying. Okay, you know what? What the hell was that? It's called a goat man. Nick, wait! Nick! Nick, I'm coming. Nick. Yep, yeah, this is where I die. Nick! Listen, I'm going to get scared out of my ass. Let me go around this. I don't want to, man. I can't see anything. I'm coming.
Hey, bud. You don't look so Nick. good. Nick, stop! It's me! Nick, get your fuck back here, you asshole. Listen, I'm gonna slap the shit out of you. You disobeyed grandma. Nick. I swear to God, dude. What? Back away from me, you idiot. Don't make me pay the price. I'm not going down there. Nah, I'm really not. I'm going up here. I can't see. Who the fuck put the scaffold here? Who? What kind of fucking idiot? No, please don't. Dude, I can't see. It's dark. I really can't. My Listen, I'm man. Down here. Come quick. Dude, man. I fucking hate you. Dude, I can't see. You know that, right? Now I can. Now I can. I can't see anything. It is pitch black. It's pitch black. Great. Endless staircases. Straight to hell. Dude. Where are you? Hold the f I'm fucking trying. Come on, dude. There we go. Hey, buddy. I'm good. You can save me, Maya. You never could. Even when we were growing up, you couldn't even protect me from myself. The accident, Alex's death, my miserable life, all of it could have been different. If only you'd done what you were supposed to do. See, that's not me. That's her. That's all on her. Who are you? What have you done to my brother? <laughs> Hey. What's up? Maya. No. I'm good. Sometime later, I found myself back in the apartment. I couldn't remember how I got there. There was no sign of Nick, or the thing that had looked like him. And his computer would no longer turn on. I did the only thing I could. I filed a missing person report and flew home. Then you're lucky. It's yeah. been six months since then. I've tried every possible way to locate him, but... There's been no word from him. I keep thinking about the thing I saw at the bottom of those stairs. The thing from inside the it's game. called a cult leader. When it came at me, just before its awful malevolence could engulf me, something, or someone, stepped between us and shielded me. Ooh, Nick? I think that's how I got away. I yeah. think... I think it was Nick who saved me. You just said you didn't know where he was and you were trying to find him. It's a good game. I'm not gonna lie, it's a good game. I actually enjoyed that. Secretly. Even though I was shitting my pants through the dark. Could have been worse, right? 
Could have been like Sophie's Curse getting a massive jump scare to the point where I fall out of my chair. I'm not playing that. Um, yeah, there you go. There's, uh, oh, that's cool. I didn't realize that in the beginning. Oh, uh, that was within. Um, so if you want to see more like this, I will do one time. I would do one tonight. So, thank you everybody so much for watching. And I am back officially. Like I said, I'd say it all the time and that I'm gone for a while, but this time, I'm not kidding. Anyways, you guys have a great day. I will see you in the next video. Bye bye. I'm still rolling.